Welcome back to one more video. Well, there, there'll be more videos than that, I guess, but <laughs> I, I'm Zara, in any case. I'm Kettle. I'm Crazed. And he's an octopus. <laughs> oh, maybe I'll have something to talk about this episode. Oh, is this the Fable Underwater episode? This is the Underwater episode. Well, there you go. Lock, he doesn't have enough. Oh, yeah, he does. Never mind. I can't get it. Okay. <laughs> Before we get too off track, um, there's something right here I need to talk about. Somebody in the thread already mentioned this, but um, there's a bug in this game. If you shoot just like your normal shot while you're dashing, it does twice as much damage. Um, it doesn't work with charge shots, just your normal like little pellet shot. And the, the little water striders here, normally they take two hits like that, but right at the beginning of the stage, I dashed and shot one, and he blew up instantly. So wow, man, we have people in the thread. Yeah, that's, that's what that's what I heard out of all that. So. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I don't know. That bug is in I think all three of the Super Nintendo um, Mega Man X games. And so it's like a legit bug then, and not some kind of feature. As far as I know, yeah, it's a bug that shouldn't happen, but for some reason they kept it in. This is your new electroshock, I guess. Um, I don't think it's really new, but I think well. You know, I might not have used it before, but I have no—I don't actually know if those like fish mini bosses are weak to that weapon. I just chose to use it. That's Pokemon again. Yeah, exactly. It's super effective. So crazy! What kind of fish are these? <laughs> I'd be hard pressed to figure that one out. So like, what are they? Were they firing things at you or what? No, those All I stupid saw was little blow, the blowfish like suck you into them. They don't actually damage you. They ah. just hold you inside of them. Story of my life, man. <laughs> <That's like>, uh, <laughs> <laughs> they they can damage you if they run into things, but otherwise, no, they're just annoying. Ah, uh, see, kettle. If it were a proper blowfish, it would have <laughs> little spikes on the along the the ventral area and all around. I feel very educated now. You ought to. About time you learned something. Jeez. About, yeah, from you about blowfish. <laughs> So water torpedo thing, yeah. <laughs> You're coming from this boat. And if you use this the little tornado there, it just tears this boat apart like nothing. That boat is a stylized whale. Hey, hey it you, is. you lied about the destructive terrain, it just happened again. Oh. Kind of <laughs> I, I, I guess I did. Oh, <laughs> caught red handed. <laughs> and this, hey, whoa! This, this, Ogopogo! <laughs> yes. <laughs> Yes, this is the Ogopogo mini boss. This level is like filled with mini bosses, and I don't know why. It's because fish are cool, I think. That's why. Yeah. So you can stand on his back and shoot him in the back of the head like that, but it kind of takes a while. <laughs> and just recently, I found out that um, if you use the little tornado again, it. Well, you'll see. Hey, whoa! Yes. Oh, whoa! <laughs> Yeah. That feels slightly manipulative to me. <laughs> It'll actually kill one of those things from full health with a single shot from that. Wow. So it's pretty handy. <laughs> and there's the other heart, there's the heart tank for this for this stage. Yeah, that bar just keeps getting bigger. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and just when you think that we've run out of mini bosses, nope. We get to fight one more. Well, I guess it's not really one more. It's just the same mini boss. Oh, it's the same. One. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the the other one. Oh, for the okay. Heart, the one for the heart tank, you don't have to fight. He's an optional one. But this guy, you do. You have to fight him. But again, one tornado. I appreciate a game that is sensitive to the economy we're using and recycling. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Yes, indeed. Heal, heal. Those uh, little snake boss things, they remind me of the uh, Battletoads games, kind of, except it's way easier, of course. But yeah. Any sequences are stupid. Yeah, these fish are really annoying. I kind of wanted to get past all of those guys without killing them, but no, I ended up killing all <laughs> three of them. Naturally. Octopus time. Yep. You know, octopus are, like, one of the freakiest creatures in the world. Too. Excuse me, octopi. Uh, yeah. yeah. Way to go. <laughs> Jeez, you, you managed to affect both of my sensibilities, Petro. <laughs> yeah, well, those sit on the cactuses. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I think oct octopi are the coolest thing ever. They're the smartest invertebrate, just so you know. 
I think. Well, there you go. They're also the most annoying invertebrate if this boss fight is anything to go by. <laughs> no, they're they're really cool animals, but I wouldn't want to like sneak next to them. Oh no, me neither. Well, for for various reasons, most of which involve Japan, but I totally agree. They're like yeah. escape artists. So. This boss fight, if you get stuck inside his little whirlwind there, he'll grab you and suck life out of you and it'll replenish his own. But there's a little trick with this boss. If you get our newfangled boomerang cutter, and if you hit him with it a few times, something magical happens. Friendship. Oh, I, I, I didn't just say that, sorry. No. <laughs> if you hit him with it three times, his tentacles get cut off. And oh, wow. The only attack cool. that he has are those little torpedoes now. He can't shoot his little homing fish, and he can't suck your life out anymore. And if you stand in that exact spot, he can't... No, he still jumps around. But his AI kind of broke for a minute. I can't help but feel a little inhumane at this. I mean, I know we spent the whole <laughs> game killing killing various facsimiles of animals, but... You cut his arms off, man! What the hell's wrong with you? You have to remember that the He robots. had it coming. But, but, but... This, um, an interesting thing to note, that's actually, like, I talked about, like, the bosses have weaknesses. That's actually technically not his weakness. That's just, oh. like, another little trick for fighting. It's, it's a bonus weakness. Yeah. There's one so more his boss. his real weakness? His real weakness is the, um, rolling shield that we got from the armadillo. Ah. The pink one. That makes sense. Yes. <laughs> and now we have a horming torpedo. Horming? <laughs> Wonderful. I Horming never torpedoes. noticed that typo until I was putting these videos together. <laughs> I never knew that that was typoed in this game until now. Assuming it is a typo. Oh, I'm sh oh hey, it's this dude again. Yeah. Zero is back. Oh, is this the end of the uh, all the choose your adventure bosses? Or no, this is just like a pointless cutscene that tells you, okay, the final stages are open, and then Zero is just like, okay, bye. <laughs> Whoa! So that's Whoa, that's, he's that's lovely. That right there is uh, Sigma. He's the big bad guy of the game. I should probably talk about him a little bit because the whole backstory is um, explained, I think, in the instruction manual. None of it is actually told throughout <laughs> the game. You know, a game is old when. Yeah. None yeah. Of the other games are like this. They all explain the story as they go. But um, uh, one more thing to note: uh, the music for this has changed as well. Uh -huh. All of the games do that after you beat the eight bosses, but before we go and fight him, we have to do backtracking. I remember this place. Yep, and if you're observant, you may notice there's water here now. This, When we first came here, there was no water. And the reason is because we just killed Launch Octopus. So now there's water in this stage. This is another. This is one of the other stages that changes depending on what boss you beat. And now that there's water, we can. You can drop down the pit. Yep. We can go down here ah. and we can make that jump <coughs> and get ourselves that heart tank. So if you get your bonus heart tank or whatever, can you just go back to the main menu? And yeah. This is what I'm doing here. Level? You can just. You, you can use that escape, and that automatically brings you back to the so stage select. But I cut that part out. So now we're in Spark Mandrill stage. You were in this so one twice already before, have right? Uh, multiple evolutions. Yeah, I'm just gonna say. This is your third time here, right? Yes. Nothing has changed though. Uh. It's the airship is still crashed here, but that's it. I did show off I think I showed that there was an energy tank back here before. But I couldn't get it because I needed this weapon. Because it does that. Hmm. It's pretty handy. Are those just random where they go? So you have to I don't think so. There is a pattern to it, but I haven't, I've never really figured it out. Also, this is the forming torpedo in action. <laughs> Can you actually form it? Or? It automatically homes into enemies. It's actually oh, nice. a pretty useful weapon. That was the only this... item we needed from that stage, so now we're... Now we're busting up Chill Penguin's place again. A it's after he's dead. In for good <laughs> Yeah. Keeping it classy. Yep. Hey, you got a dragonfly. Mm -hmm. Insects don't do well in the winter. Yep. If you've got the, f the fire wave, you can blow up these little igloos and get the items inside. That's where the heart tank mm -hmm. is in that stage. 
So these are just basically buffing your stats for the final boss. Kind of yes, thing. I now have all of the items that I can get, except for one upgrade, which is what I'm doing here. It's a secret upgrade. Uh, it's kind of it is well, it is an Easter egg, but it's also like the most ridiculously broken thing in the game. <laughs> but the method to getting it is kind of roundabout and pretty annoying, as you will soon find out. Oh. I still like those mole creatures, they're kind of... They're pretty cool. There's nice. actually, again, someone in the thread pointed out that um, the second one that you see in this level, you can just slide down the side wall, and you'll land in front of him so you don't have to kill him, and then you can grab the heart tank that way if you want. But yeah. I just did it the way I did it to show that you can kill him from behind. Um, but the only thing to note is if you fall on the spikes, it will kill you instantly. So, so far this seems pretty pretty legit, but the same as last time. Yeah, there's not really much to talk about. We've kind of seen this already. The bats are still really annoying, though. Go kart riding? Yep. I really do like the design of the bats, though. Just they are pretty saying. cool. They're like steampunk or something. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh yeah, if you jump off the cart in the right place, you can like fly right into that little hallway. And yeah, right here. So we don't even need to wait for him. <laughs> it's actually really handy because in order to get the secret upgrade, you kind of need to go through this part about three more times. Man, I like this. This is the, like the glitch here. It's kind of fun. The slow down. Yeah, it's kind of neat. It makes you feel. I like it too. Kind of epic. Yeah, so, exactly. There's nothing up there, right? And I guess I can just end the stage, right? Well, no. Take I'm, a card. I'm, I'm, card. I'm gonna go kill oh, myself. No. <laughs> okay, let's see if I can try that again. Oh, good grief. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> This is go totally going to kill our conversation here, I think. I think so. No, no, it, it'll survive. It'll survive. How's the weather where you guys live? It's been stormy and muggy. Yeah, pretty much. Weather, really? That, that's the most stereotypical thing you can default into. Thanks, man. What oh. are you wearing? <laughs> <laughs> I refuse to answer that one. Blue jeans. <laughs> Actually, We're bringing Black a webcam actually. into this, I know. I, I don't remember why I went into the start menu there for a second. I think it was just to show off that I had all my energy tanks filled. <laughs> oh. There we go. Man, Easter eggs back in the day were pretty intense. Like, you might think nowadays, so. game design, they wouldn't play You might think so, but... Spoiler alert, this is all according to plan. Oh yeah, no, I figured that, like, uh... Yeah, they were like they were harder to find, and they were a lot more just roundabout in order to get them. They're less intuitive, which is exactly what you said. But I'm being redundant because this video is redundant. <laughs> it is actually. It really is. It's a very good observation. I might even just like speed some of this up because this is pretty boring. It's just the same thing four times. But if you do that, if you get to that ledge and you jump off and kill yourself three times, then the fourth time, something a little different will happen. Um, this is the fourth time. This is the fourth time. Honestly, I, I would like to know who spent all the time figuring this out. I mean, seriously. I don't know. Killing yourself four times. That's a good point. Three times. Probably the guy that was employed at like Nintendo Power or something. <laughs> just hates, yeah. his just hates his life. But anyway. <laughs> I remember those magazines. Oh, oh, now, there's, there's a capsule up here. And if you'll notice, uh, Dr. Light is dressed as um, one of the Street Fighter characters. He's dressed as uh, Ryu. <laughs> <laughs> and he has a special present for us. His vest is open a little too wide for my taste. Yeah. <laughs> so what are you wearing? <laughs> <laughs> See? You think sure I can. It all comes for us in full circle. So now... We get a new weapon. We can. Hadouken. Yep. We can throw head opens. He even says it. Wow. He does actually. It's kind of hard to hear. But... I like. <laughs> I like how you get it after like failing so much. He's like, you need help. And then yeah, it's kind of funny that way. <laughs> but the thing is, 
Um, I told you it was ridiculously broken. It kills everything in the game in a single hit. Oh. Oh wow. Yeah. 